it is really difficult to go year by year, how, how to pay my tuition every semester. Um, there are semesters when I'm close to just not going that semester because I cannot find enough money to pay for that for tuition that year. Every year, many students have to balance full-time jobs, full-time classes, and internships in order to not only pay for tuition, but to graduate on time. The New York State Leadership Council gathered in front of Governor Cuomo's office in order to have their voices heard, as a reminder that the New York State Dream Act should be included in the executive budget. It's something really hard. In order for me to actually continue going to college, I had to um, actually work three jobs, three part-time jobs, because I actually got a scholarship for $20,000, but they took it away from me since I didn't have papers, since I didn't have social security or a green card. So I was very unfortunate, and this is the reason why I'm actually here, because I want to make sure that my same situation or the same struggles that I went through, other students don't have to go through those same struggles. My little sister too, she's undocumented, and right now she's in high school, and I know that eventually she's going to go through the same things that I'm going through. I do not want her to have to worry every semester like me, whether I'm going to go to school or not. Not have to think about just giving up on your education. Since everything in order for me to pay for school was really difficult, um, it has gotten to the point where you know you start feeling depressed and stressed, and it's that is that many people struggle to that. Trying to pay for tuition is it's not just hurting you. Of your economically, but also affecting you psychologically and, and, and your emotions too. Solidarity between teachers and students is crucial to create a more comprehensive unity amongst undocumented students and educational nurturers. That afternoon, it was felt. However, we have yet to see how the DREAM Act will be passed. On January 2015, Governor Cuomo has included the DREAM Act in his executive budget. However, he has put it into a bundle with the Education Tax Credit Bill. The Education Tax Credit Bill aims to create a tax credit for those who donate money to public and private schools schools. Activists, students and teachers fear that this action could defund public education in the future. The we actually, I mean, the colleges eventually will be floated, I mean, positively speaking, obviously, um, by New York, I mean, by undocumented students. That's a major barrier that they're actually, I mean, that is actually preventing them from going to college. So as soon as the New York Dream Act passes, these students will, I mean, will attain a higher education and subsequently with their higher, the higher education, they will get a better job that will infuse with a better economic condition to this state itself. Because it's not only a one-way benefit, it's not only that its students, undocumented students will get benefited, but eventually by getting a better job, these students will actually contribute to a better economy for this country. people that were actually still afraid of coming out and instead of being more encouraging as these teachers I mean the high school teachers are right now some of them didn't give us the assistance because it was kind of a taboo especially in New York 2004 around 2004 2005 not many teachers were proactively I mean supporting their students as they are actually right now so it's a very gratifying um, actually image to see so many high school students doing so great a thing for undocumented students that they stand with solidarity with us and it's actually very inspiring. Teachers, teachers are, are the most important gatekeepers to students because they spend a lot of time with them. They're kind of like secondary parents. And so by showing that teachers and students are united in this and do want the DREAM Act to pass and do want to support their students, it'll show that, that this is important enough that it needs to pass now. Whether, whether it's with this bill or whether it's not, it's, it's important that it passes in general. By supporting the DREAM Act and by helping these group of students who are currently not properly being funneled into higher education, but instead fall through the cracks, that, that it shows a, a form of solidarity between the two.